What's going on everybody? Hello, welcome back to the channel. Um, today we're doing the first light episode, it's only a short um, light episode, but we're doing a kitchen in the bongo, or a sort of like worktop unit, somewhere I can put the, that just freaked me out, door just slammed. Um, somewhere I can put the cooker, maybe a little sink, something like that, but um, yeah, so I'm gonna do like a few different episodes of me hoping to build it. Um, I'm not very good at wood. So, more of a cables sort of person. So, I'm going to give it a go um, and see what happens. But yeah, I'll take it to the bongo. We're going to have a look. Right, so here's the van at the minute. Got the rear seats in. Uh, got the middle seats out. Some wood saw. But this is like a little bit of a ignore uh, that piece. But I wasn't sure whether to go along and then in and then use this seat belt um, bolt as a as a mount or I don't know whether to go for um, sort of like that shape ignore that so along and down there I don't know if I have it this way you get more leg room in the back Whereas that way you get more space in the van. Oh, I don't know what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna have a look anyway, inside here, because then I'm gonna need either way, whichever way I go, um, I'm gonna need to, well, at least move that. But I wanna see what's behind here, see if that's movable as well. So I'm gonna have a little look. Right, I've had the screw out of the, uh, out of there. Taking these two screws out. It just looks like inside you've got some heat and vents and this thing, controller. So it's just plugged in at the minute, but that's definitely, uh, I can cut this and rejoin the cables if I need to extend it. But I mean, if I went with this route, I could probably peel some of that tape back in there on that little loom. I could probably peel some of that back and get it to come out of here and then have it sat in the front of that. Oh, I don't know. Oh, it's gone forever now. Yeah, don't know, I'm not sure what to do. I'm gonna have a tinker and a play. Right, so I've asked the missus, seen what she thinks as well. Um, we've scrapped, oh yeah, we've scrapped this way. I think it's gonna take up too much room because if it sits to here where my legs are, I'll no longer be able to chill with my feet out. So, we're going to go for that option. Um, I've got the cooker there just to give us a rough size, but that's the plan, is to put that on the worktop, not sink it in or anything, but have a worktop that will take that if we want to use it. And then this side, what I'm thinking is maybe putting a, a sink and then a little, uh, a little tap and a small water tank underneath and a pump to pump for the tank and then we'll put a drain in somewhere. That's the plan, whether it will work or not, I don't know, but um, I'm going to go and mock something up. I'm just trying to figure out as well where I'm going to fix to. So I'm thinking if I remove this, there's, uh, you probably see better on there, there's some bolt holes. Oh, that's my finger. There, there's some bolt holes, or some bolts even. If I take this one out, there'll be two bolt holes there, so I can probably use them to fix to. Um, like some of the framing fix into there I don't know whether I'll be able to fix like to screw straight down in here or not I haven't really peeled it back but leave a comment below there's only be a short one like an introduction just to show you what the plan is leave a comment below if you've done this before or um, you know anything about what's underneath so before I tear it all out and try and see, see if there's any cables open. Pretty sure it's all underneath on here. I think it's like just some insulation and stuff like that. But obviously I want to make it fixed down pretty hard. Pretty hard, pretty well secure. Um, what else? I don't know. This is just like a little part one. So I'm going to do it in a few little videos because otherwise it's going to be like one mammoth long task. But this is like the planning, um, where it's going to go, roughly where it's going to go. And then I just want to like read any comments or suggestions on what you would do while I'm doing it because then it's a lot easier um, with some help. 
Uh, yeah, so at the minute, this is the bongo just chilling. All back to front now. There's the Kager. So, got the saw ready. Probably won't be making any cuts today, but we'll see. Um, but that's the plan. I've ordered, well, no, I haven't. I'm going to go and order a sink that's going to go in here. Um, we've got the, the fuse boxes behind the glove box down there. You can just about see it. There you go. Um, so we've got that ready to take a pump for the little sink. Um, if you haven't seen the video on that, there's, uh, I'll leave the little card up there so you can watch that. Um, yeah, should be good. This is all we need really. We're not making it into a camper. We was going to make it into a full camper build, bed and all sorts, but sort of going through everything and, and talking about it, like I don't need it as a camper. I'm never really going to sleep in it. We use it as a day van. Just going out, mooching around and having some chips and whatever. That's the, the main use of the old bongo. So I thought, why why bother making beds and all this sort of thing and cramping myself in when I ain't going to need it anyway. So yeah, day van it is. So anyway, yeah, let me know what you think. Leave some comments and stuff below. Any tips, suggestions, help, all that sort of thing. Thanks for watching. And yeah, I'll see you on the next video. And don't forget to subscribe if you want to watch the uh, watch the build. I'm nearly, what am I at? 860 subscribers, I think. Which is pretty good. Didn't expect that. Um, yeah, let's see if we can get to 900 soon. See how we get on. But yeah, if you haven't, if you haven't subscribed, hit the subscribe button below. It helps out massively. Um, and it'd be, yeah, it'd be good to follow along with this little, I'm not going to say a build. It's a an electrician whacking together a load of wood so it's probably going to come out awful but i'm going to, I'm going to try my best i'm going to make it look as pretty as i can which yeah we'll see right anyway thanks for watching see you on the next one